evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood-red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. We must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. <sighs> Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is May. And I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs, with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. You'll be sharing this room with Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now, but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. <laughs> it's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. 
But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go! Finally prized yourself from your... All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. <laughs> Not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. Ah, now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now pick it up. Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the Guildwood's entrance, while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Well done, lad. The beetles are all dead. You can come out of the woods now. Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. <laughs> 